Hello everyone. Welcome to Gradient Maris Academy. So we are asked to solve for y given that 6 is the power of y divided by 3 is the power of y is equal to 100 divided by 5 is the power of y. This is an interesting equation. So we are given that 6 is the power of y divided by 3 is the power of y is equal to 100 divided by 5 is the power of y. So now, the left hand side can be expressed as 6 divided by 3 all raised to the power of y equal to, at this point we have 10 squared divided by 5 raised to the power of y. 6 divided by 3 is 2, so we have 2 raised to the power of y equal to 10 squared divided by 5 raised to the power of y. So we can cross multiply. So we have 2 to the power of y times 5 to the power of y is equal to 10 squared. But from a product power law, we have that if a to the power of n times b to the power of n, this can be expressed as a times b all to the power of n, provided that they have the same index. So at this point, we apply this knowledge here. This becomes 2 times 5 all raised to the power of y equal to 10 raised to the power of 2. 2 times 5 is 10, so we have 10 raised to the power of y equal to 10 raised to the power of 2. Now, since their bases are the same, we have that y is equal to 2. Yes, y is equal to 2. Thank you so much for always watching our videos. And if this is your first time of seeing that video, please encourage us by liking this video and following our page. I have a complete series of indices, indexial equations, indexial expressions that leads to quadratic and so many math Olympiad questions on indices in my YouTube channel. If you wish to learn more, see our channel at Radiant Minds Academy. And I wish you a happy learning journey. Bye.